Hey guys, I am going to cook a copycat meal today. I'm actually going to cook a Chili's sa uh, Southern Egg Rolls. Have you ever had those? Well, that's what I'm going to cook today, or tried to cook today. Um, I bought a half of a rotisserie chicken. Have you ever seen a half? Here in Quartzsite at Roadrunner, they sell half of chicken. But it's a rotisserie chicken. And... Um, I will bring y'all along. And I'm making, I looked up several recipes online, so, uh, I kind of combined some of them. So, it's copycat, but kind of with my own, um, I actually have a can of, uh, chicken that's already opened. I may use that too, we'll see, because I'm going to use a whole can of black beans, a whole can of um, corn and I'm not making the ranch avocado dip I'm just going to use this avocado dip so we're going to see how it comes out so y'all come along I'm going to debone this get to deboning this and um, see how much chicken I have left so there will probably be enough chicken but we'll see I'm going to use my new, well, new to me, new, since uh, December, the Ozark Trail pocket knife to cut this off the bone. I might have to eat some while I'm at it, because it looks good. Mm hmm All right. I'm going to get this deboned and cut up. And then we'll go to the next step. Almost done cutting up the chicken. I want it pretty small since it has to go into a egg roll type. Egg roll type setting. <laughs> Just have the dark meat to finish. And then we'll get on to the other mixture. So the recipe I saw, or several of them that I saw, called for a red uh, a red bell pepper. I have this bell pepper and I need to use it, so it's going to be yellow. One jalapeno and the scallions. Green onion scallions. You don't use the, the actual onions. So I'm going to get this chopped up. So I'm not the only one eating this, so I am only going to use a half a jalapeno, um, and I can always add more, but I can't take it away, so I'm going to start with that much right now. And now we saute. I guess I should move this paper plate of chicken out of the way. Peppers, scallions, and jalapenos are going in. Add the chicken. That is a lot of chicken. That's a half a half a chicken. Half of a rotisserie chicken. 
This is black beans and corn drained and rinsed. called for frozen spinach. They did not have any frozen spinach at the local grocery store here in Quartzsite. So I'm going to add fresh spinach. And I probably need to add quite a bit. I'm going to need my new cast iron skillet lid. So this will all work down. That's a lot of, a lot of food in this pot. I'm saving my other, my deep dish for frying, so that's why I didn't cook it in that. So I just put all the spices in this little bowl. And now we add eight ounces of Monterey Jack cheese. I'm going to do this in stages. I don't want to lose anything over the side. Okay, get all the cheese in. Now we're just waiting. Stir it up until it's melted really good. Then we'll fill the tortillas and fry some egg rolls. Almost ready. We're gonna have lots of egg rolls. I think we're gonna make two batches some today and some tomorrow. And now we stuff them. It said two tablespoons of filling. I don't want to get too much. I guess, oop! Corn down, man. Corn down, man. Shame you'll find the leftovers, I'm sure. And you roll. Or oh, this one's kind of small, but maybe I'll do this first. And then tuck and roll. Still need to tuck some more. Tuck it in, tuck it in. Oops. Hmm. If you can't tuck it, you might as well eat it. Uh -huh. There's a little egg roll, and it's said to put some toothpicks in it. And I'm going to do a few of these, and then I'm going to get the oil warming up. We're going to have egg rolls for days. Oop, tuck and roll. Or roll and tuck. It's the opposite. Roll and tuck. So I'm just using a cheap vegetable oil. And um, I may try a different oil next time. But this time I just got the whole oil heating up. And and we'll place the little egg rolls in there. We'll see how they come out. Alright. Now they're in. They're frying up. I think I might be able to get the other two in there. We'll see. So I've got six of them in here frying. That's all I have rolled up so far. But I have a whole lot left. I either need to fry up a whole bunch. Well, I think I'll fry up some later for dinner. So still probably going to have leftovers. So probably will freeze that and make another batch soon. Mm -hmm. Excited. Okay, those are looking good. They're almost done. I'm going to take them out here in a minute and, and eat lunch. Let's eat. 
Bon Appetit. As the wind blows in. It what? is so good. Is it good? It's, it's better than chilies. Uh, no, it's better than chilies. I need to work on it still. It's better than chilies. No. It's good. It's good. Let's see inside. <laughs> My mouth. It's hot. Can't see. All right. Let's try the guacamole dip. Guacamole dip. We need a bowl. The crema. Crema. Thank you.